Well, hello everyone. Even though Memorial Day comes the last possible time on the calendar that it can exist on May 31st, it's hard to believe that this coming weekend is already Memorial Day weekend. Wow, has spring went really fast this year. Well, as we enter into this time in the church, as we the season of Pentecost beginning uh, this last Sunday with the celebration of the day of Pentecost, this Sunday, Holy Trinity Sunday, and then those many Sundays of the time after Pentecost, a few things change in our church as well. First of all, Sunday school has now concluded for the summer as usual. I want to thank Kathy Owinski for doing the one-room classroom for those who are able to come here this spring. Greatly appreciate her and her helpers to be able to pull that off. We now look forward to the Sunday after Labor Day, where I believe that is September 12th, and we hope to resume our full schedule with Sunday School back in between the both worship services. Uh, we will resume the adult class at that time, as well as hopefully Sunday School for all ages. So watch for news on that. Also, for those of you who continue to worship online, you will notice some changes in the coming weeks to the format. First of all, you will not see a lay reader for a while. I am going to stop that part of the taping and only read those lessons that have to do directly with the sermon. It's not because I think those lessons are frivolous, but the challenge is of getting a lay reader, recording that, editing adds a whole other um, hoop to the process. I'm trying to simplify that a little bit. And so going forward, uh, at least for the near future, uh, you'll notice a few changes in that service format. As far as in-person format, you certainly know about the changes in the um, face mask covering option that we began uh, this past Sunday and will continue into the future. We'll also be making uh, other changes to the services throughout the summer as we hopefully continue to move toward normal. Uh, first of all, we're going to have a setting change uh, beginning this Sunday, but also other aspects of hopefully beginning to get to that new normal in terms of music and other aspects of our liturgy together. So we hope to participate in that and do that throughout this summer. In the meantime, I hope you are enjoying some great weather as we embark on some of the funnest months of the year for many. And please, take care, dear church.